up, everyone? It's Phoenix here, bringing you guys another reaction. This time it is Christmas Carols by The Odd Ones Out. We're just jump right into this. So here we go. It's called Christmas Carols. Merry Christmas. Yeah, that's right. I said it. What are you gonna do about it, atheists? Christmas carols are an integral <laughs> part of creating the Christmas atmosphere. Okay, yes, I agree. It's annoying when radio stations play Christmas music directly after Halloween, but when December finally rolls around and Michael Bublé emerges from his cave, <laughs> magic fills the air. And if you work in retail, you've probably already listened to every single Christmas song. <laughs> after many hours of research, I have found that there's two types Decorate. of Christmas music. On one side, you have songs about Santa Claus, and on the other side, you have songs about Jesus. Isn't it funny that Santa is an anagram for Satan? <laughs> Just like think about it. Christmas is easily the most sung about mm, Halloween. Halloween think about. isn't even in a close second, but it's also the most diverse genre of music out there. You have songs like Away in a Manger and Silent Night that can put anyone to sleep, but under the same umbrella, you have Santa Baby and Christmas Don't Be Late by Alvin and the Chipmunks. I love Christmas carols, okay? <laughs> it's one of the few good things left in this world that brings a smile to my face. <laughs> but now I want to talk about the Christmas carols that don't make a lot of sense. Starting with the song Silent Night. Okay, sure, I've never given birth before, but I don't know if all is calm, all is bright, <laughs> the process of childbirth. I get that it was Jesus and he was perfect, okay? But he's still a baby. Mary still had to go into labor. I don't know. I see all these nativity scenes with Jesus being the center of attention and Mary just off to the side with everyone else. But she just gave birth, you guys. Someone needs to go Mary Also, sleep in heavenly peace? Yeah, you're not going to do that ever again. So the song of last Christmas is about when Taylor Swift gave someone her heart for Christmas, but then on December 26th, they re-gifted it to someone else. So then the very next year, she gave it to someone special. I don't know what the moral of the song is, but it could have been about any holiday. They just happened to break up the day after Christmas. <laughs> last Earth Day, I gave you my heart. So Walking in a winter wonderland? I have a question. Who is Parson Brown? Why is the first thing he says when he comes to life? Hey, uh, are you kids married? No, man. But you can do the job when you're in town, if you know what I'm saying. Oh, Parson is a priest. He was asking, are you married? Because I'm a priest. I can marry you two. That's my job. Ah. Carol of the Bell? <laughs> I love the song. It's but job. honestly, I don't see how this counts as Christmas music. Have a holly jar for Christmas? <laughs> what do you mean by kiss her once for me? Are you cheating on me? Baby, it's <laughs> outside. Okay, now this one is extremely problematic. Why don't they just put a coat on? <laughs> what I love for Christmas is my two front teeth, a hippopotamus, and you. <laughs> I would not want to meet the person who Christmas, just saying. I'm getting nothing for Christmas. How did I not know about this song until just now? All right, how many Christmas songs can say they got a movie based off of them? Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer? Yeah, yeah, it's classic. Frosty the Snowman? Mm -hmm, yeah, good choice. Uh, the Little Drummer Boy got a movie? Okay, fine, yeah, I'll count that. I think you're all missing the real classical Christmas song. Grandma got ran over by <laughs> In the song, it's canon that Grandma died, but at least in the movie, Grandma lived. She just got kidnapped by Santa because he was trying to hide the evidence. You know, no way. I hope they don't make a Baby It's Cold Outside movie. Just an hour and a half of people not putting on jackets. Anyways, I'll keep this video extremely short if I want to get it out by Christmas. I hope you all have a good holiday, and if you don't celebrate Christmas, you're missing out on some great carols <laughs> and questionable morals. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I'm going to be taking some time off to celebrate oh, Christmas man. with my family. Remember to buy that merch. And as always, wear your seatbelt. <laughs> wear your seatbelt. Wait, he didn't have his scrawler thing. Whatever. All right. So that was a great video. Lots of fun. Um, I really enjoyed that. Um, not much else to say about that. Uh, it was enjoyable to watch, but, uh, yeah. Anyways. Thank you guys so much for talking by. Um, leave a like on this video if you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe for more content. And peace out, guys. It's been a blast.